Any lighting cameraman or director of photography will remember the redhead with affection. Strong, sturdy, reliable, flexible, it was the mainstay of many a documentary team and news team throughout the world. And in fact, it's still in use in television studios and on location on movies today. The redhead, or Janeiro Vary Beam, to give it its correct title, does have one slight disadvantage in that it requires 800 watts of power, being a tungsten unit. However, there is good news. There is now an LED version of the light, and this is what we're going to look at in this video. There are numerous advantages to using LEDs. Firstly, they hardly use any power. You can light a location from a domestic power supply. With the latest generation of Yaneros, you could run a dozen daylight units from the domestic supply and still have power to spare. Secondly, they're cool. They don't cook the talent and you can use them without turning the location into an oven. They're stable, you can shake them, and if you're a little bit over enthusiastic when you move them, you're not worried that you're going to blow the bulb. Finally, turn them off, pack them away. You don't have to wait for them to cool down in the D-Rig. When buying an LED unit, the most important thing to remember is to buy new. Don't go for second hand. Technology is constantly evolving and firms are spending a fortune to make sure their equipment is up to the latest specification. The current units from Yanero, for example, have a CRI well into the 90s. This would simply have not been possible even a few years ago. The thing is, if you buy second hand, you don't know how the unit has been used or abused. You don't know if it's been allowed to overheat. You don't know how many hours that it's been used. And LED units do have a finite life. The better the unit, the longer the life. But you've got no way of checking how many hours this LED has been burning. Well, that's just been a very brief introduction to one of the new LED units from Yanero, the Redhead LED. There will be further videos in this series explaining other units, how to use them, and how to get the best out of your LED lighting. If you need to know anything more, just go to the website, www.yanero.com.